During the dark days of Nazi rule, millions of Jews were killed in concentration camps. Many were murdered using gas chambers. But what if I told you, the gas that filled those chambers wasn't created by a Nazi, but by a Jewish scientist? His name was Fritz Haber, a German chemist, a Nobel Prize winner, who once saved the world from starvation. But his legacy is stained with tragedy. In the early 1900s, the Earth faced a food crisis. Haber invented a way to pull nitrogen from the air, creating synthetic fertilizer. His process helped feed billions. But as war loomed, Haber's brilliance took a darker turn. He turned to chemical warfare, developing chlorine gas, a weapon first unleashed on soldiers in World War I. It was the birth of modern chemical weapons. His wife, Clara Immervar, was a chemist too, a passionate pacifist. She begged him not to use science for destruction. But Haber refused. The night he returned from supervising a gas attack, Clara took his pistol and ended her life. Haunted, Haber pressed on. And years later, one of the chemicals developed from his work, Zyklon B, a pesticide meant to kill insects, was repurposed by the Nazis. Zyklon B was used in the gas chambers to murder millions of Jews. He never intended this and never lived to see it. Consider subscribing to our channel to know more such stories.